favor, that, that was a nervous wait, but I mean, you finally made it to the semi-final. How does it make you feel to be back on the track, doing what you know how to do best? Uh, I wasn't nervous. I just, um, you know, it's a few ways the way, not the way my coach tells me, but, you know, it didn't work out well. I'm just trying to like, you know, take it one race at a time, um, try my best, take off being hurt from my head and just take it one step at a time and see how, how everything is going to turn out. Um, how have you grown I mean, from that teenage girl in Doha to Eugene and now? You must be so proud about your progress. Um, how would you say you've been able to be consistently manage all of this to run at this world stage? I mean, I just have to grow. I don't. We can't change anything. But I, from the favor of last year, I'm still the same. But it's just different mentality from getting hurt and learning that you know you have to be there for yourself. You need to change some aspect of yourself and you know keep pushing every day because this sport is like a job now. Yeah. You just have to put everything in it. So. And, and, and last year you ran over 60 races, you were spent. This year, did you intentionally want to reduce the amount of races you ran community world? Oh, if you heard me earlier, I said I was hurt. So okay. getting hurt, I couldn't run. Oh. And, you know, trying to come back from injury Sorry about and that. getting strong. And, you know, here I am again trying to finish the season strong and all that. Uh, yeah. Mentally, how have you been able to prep yourself or talking about the injury now to bring yourself here and still push to now make it to the semi final? I mean, that must, you must really feel proud about yourself doing that. Oh, yeah, I'm proud of my. I mean, I'm proud of the process that I'm getting here because I don't really have the choice but to make myself mentally strong because I know. If someone told me by May that I'll be here after getting hurt, I won't believe it. But you know, my coach and my trainers trying to get me back, and you know, I just I have no choice but to be and, here. And I mean. Just two weeks ago, your fans all over social media were like, oh, people finally signed with Adidas. I mean, congratulations on that, first oh, of all. Um, any message to your fans who have been rooting for you? Um, just keep praying for me. You know, I need you guys prayer because I want to finish this season happy. Whatever, no matter the outcome, I just want to be, you know, happy with, happy with this World Championship stuff and, you know, go home feeling like, yeah, I came here again. And wore this shirt again, regardless of whatever anybody is saying out there, and you know, be happy. That's all. All the best in the sense.